Hi everyone, I'm Brian Trasick, Product Manager at Pepperland Fuchs. And in this video, we're going to discuss how we can use our advanced diagnostic module for Foundation Field Bus and Profibus PA and how all of the functions for that module can be accessed using Pactware and the DTM. Now the DTM allows us to not only commission, but also do online monitoring and troubleshooting, all from the comfort of the control room. Online monitoring of your Foundation Field Bus or Profibus PA segments is simple using the advanced diagnostic module from Pepperone Fuchs and its DTM. First thing that we're going to do is take a look at we call, what we call our global diagnostic screen. So we right click on the FDS and go to diagnosis and this is a quick and easy screen where if we had many many ADMs we would be able to see all of those on a single screen and quickly be able to decipher if there's no error or if there was some error on an ADM. So if I create some kind of error, you can see that it pops right up on the screen out of specification. And you have an, an option up here to show all segments, whether there's an error or not, or you can define uh, only segments that have an error, seg segments that have had an error within a certain time frame, things like that. Online monitoring, it's going to be a right click on the ADM and measured value. So this is a more specific to a single diagnostic module and it's going to show us all of the measured values that that diagnostic module sees on a specific segment. So you can see the first thing over here on the left hand side is the device navigation. So you can click which segment on that diagnostic module you want to look at. In this case we're going to look at segment one. And if we scroll down we can see we have uh, system and motherboard measurements. So we can see that we have both uh, redundant power supply modules plugged in and they're okay. And if we scroll down farther, we can see the individual segment measurements that are being taken. So this is an easy way with the bar graphs to see are we within a good range, are we within excellent, or maybe we're out of spec, which we can see here. We have the yellow out of spec triangle, and so our unbalance is now at a 92%. In this video, we're going to discuss troubleshooting your Foundation Field Bus and Profibus PA segments using the Advanced Diagnostic Module from Pepperell and Fuchs. Now, with the DTM software and the Advanced Diagnostic Module, troubleshooting your segments is much quicker and much easier. The first step that we're going to do is right-click on the FDS and click on Diagnosis. So this brings up our global diagnostic screen. And right here we can see we've selected the uh, to only show current alarms. So we only get any ADMs that are currently in an alarm. And we can see right now that it's segment one and we have an out of specification alarm. So this is a quick way to see all of the segments that will have a problem. And from here, it's a as easy as clicking on the open button and we can drill down directly to that segment to find out what the problem is. So now we're at the individual segment diagnosis screen and this can be accessed as well by right clicking on the ADM and going down to diagnosis. It's grayed out now because we already have the window open. Uh, going from the global alarm screen is easier and faster and we can see what our current alarm is and unbalance is out of specification to the positive pole. So right off the bat we would be able to see and if there were multiple alarms they would all be listed here. So maybe I can create some more. So now we can see here I created a new alarm and I added some noise to the segment 
and the first alarm that additional alarm that we got was noise is maintenance required and then it went to noise is out of specification so now if we click on either of these alarms down below you see the information change and this is a truly powerful tool that's included with the software where we provide actionable information and troubleshooting tips to tell you where to go to fix whatever current problems you have. So instead of just knowing uh, uh, that there's a value that's out of specification, now we're also going to tell you how to get that value back into specification. So it's valuable information that saves you time uh, and really directs you where to go to solve the problems and get the plant back up and running as quickly as possible.